Books are a uniquely portable magic. Myself, Dr. Smiley Pruthi, I am pleased to announce the release of my book, second edition of Conceptual Review of Biochemistry for PG Aspirants. So I would like to give an introduction about this book. In this book, uh, I have written explanations of all the MCQs which are given. All the MCQs, I have not even left one MCQ for which explanation is not given. So this is a very good thing which students uh, enjoy reading. So this book is one stop solution for having your all the queries in biochemistry. You can just do this book and nothing else is required. All the questions covered in all the last five year exams are covered in this book. And in the theory, all the topics are also covered. No need to do any other topic. The first chapter in this book is on concepts, which you will not find in any other book. This chapter on concepts will link all the uh, biochemical pathways and the formulas which I have created. Yes, few formulas I have created, which I have written in the starting of this book. These formulas help a lot in connecting all the biochemistry concepts. That's why I have named this chapter as concepts. There is formula about anabolic catabolic pathway, which hormone insulin and glucagon activate which enzyme and which pathway, which pathway occurs in which compartment of the cell and which enzyme is active in phosphorylated and which enzyme is active in dephosphorylated state. A general formula is given which you can apply on all the questions, right? I have given recent 2019 questions, biochemistry questions in the starting of this book, which you can have a look and the explanations will be given in respective chapters. In each chapter, you will be uh, encountering many boxes, flowcharts, which all will make reading very easy. During my experience of teaching, whatever questions, whatever doubts I have received from students, whatever are frequently asked doubts, I have put them in boxes in this first I have written the question the doubt and then its solution which are frequently asked when any chapter is started there is an overview of chapter where star marking is done for example given two stars five stars or four stars depending upon which topics are frequently asked so if you have less time you can just do the five star marked topics here in the end of each chapter, pearls of the chapter are given, which are one-liners of the chapter. When in the end you are revising, then you can just give two to three hours in revising all these one-liners of the book. Then in MCQs, in the end of chapter, MCQs are given and here I have not repeated the questions. If some questions are repeated, then I have just marked these questions as FAQ, frequently asked questions. So do these FAQs very nicely. In the end of the book, few tables are given, like homophones in biochemistry, few matching and confusing names, like what is dextran, dextrose, dextrin, all are given together. So called homophones in biochemistry. Then a vitamin table, biochemical test table, table of minerals, most abundant, all the most abundant things given in one table, all the most common things given in one table, very very good very very helpful for revision and in the end of the book 100 plus image based questions you will find which you should practice two to three times because recently image based questions are a trend in your exams within the theory you can see uh, at various places i have given a cue marking uh, to emphasize that this topic is frequently asked in questions the book is written in very very easy language Usually the main problem in biochemistry is that the language is very tough. But I have taken this thing in my mind when I started writing this book that I'll write it in a very, very easy language. In fact, I have oversimplified the things. Even this book is useful for FMG students, foreign medical graduates for their MCI screening exam. You can just skip the additional edge boxes given, which are for additional information. You can just skip that and do the remaining of the book and it will be very useful in making the concepts. Also, the book can be used by first year MBBS students for their professional theory exams 
as concept building is the most important thing required for any exam and the last but not the least the revision from the book will be very easy you can just do the high return boxes and you can do the one liners given in the end of the chapter so best wishes to you i will wait for your reviews of the book Thank you.